This isn't so much a tutorial as it is a quick tip on how you can set up your variables in your class files for objects that are in your, on your storyboard very quickly. I can't take total credit for this as I saw this in a presentation video on something else, but I thought it was so cool that it, was, it deserved its own little call out. So I'm starting off with just a simple file in a single view project template. And on the initial view controller, I've just put in, I've just dragged in a uh, text field and a button. Now I'm going to set up the variables for the, the properties for these, the property variables for both of these items with this quick shortcut. First, I'm going to hide the panel on the right hand side here uh, so I have more screen space. And I'm going to click on the assistant editor. Normally, I'd use this to see my .h file and .m file, the, the interface and implementation files, right next to each other. But in this case, I'm going to use it to see uh, my visual representation, my storyboard, and my interface file right next to each other. So I'm going to switch this over to my uh, interface file. And now to set up the property declaration for the text field, I'm just going to click on the text field and then control drag over to the interface file and let go. And when I do that, this window will pop up and I can give the property variable a name. I'll call it my text field. And there's a couple other variables I can set, whether I want it to be strong or weak, and it should already select the right uh, type, class type for me. And when I press connect, the property declaration will appear in my .h, in my .h file. I'm going to do the same thing for my button as well, selecting it and then control dragging into the interface, and I'll name this my button, and connect. Now the cool thing about that is I'm going to switch back to my the normal view I use and then I can see that in the .h file of course I've got the declarations written out for me that we just created but also in the .m file you can see that those properties are already been synthesized as well and in my view did unload uh, they've been set to nil. If I wasn't using arc it would also create a dialog dialog method in here with those uh, variables also released for me. Finally, I can see that on the storyboard, when I select the file and then open up my connections inspector, I can see that for both of those uh, visual interfaces, the connections have already been made as well. Uh, the referencing outlets have been set to my text field and my button, respectively. So. Those four things have already been done for me. The, the declaration in the .h file, uh, property declaration, synthesize, the setting to nil in the, in the view did unload, and the connections are already made for me using that quick shortcut. So that way you can make your declarations very quickly and get on to writing your code.